I am Satyake Mukherjee from class 7Z. Today I have made a science project on the topic Eco-Friendly Materials for Global Well-Being. Nowadays our main concern is that our Mother Earth is getting polluted mostly with the single-use plastics. So to prevent our Earth from pollution, we should use the eco-friendly materials. Now what are eco-friendly materials? Eco-friendly means nature-friendly. These materials are obtained from the plant and animal sources. They cause no harm to the nature and is totally reusable and recyclable. Now, let's talk about some of the eco-friendly materials. The single-use plates made from the sugarcane residue. residue. After this is the sugarcane residue plate. After the sugarcane juice is extracted, the fibrous residue is pressed, pulled and molded into the desired shape to make plates by applying heat and pressure. It is totally biodegradable in nature and is eco-friendly. Now, let's talk about the plates made from the palm leaves. The palm leaf plates are made from the fallen leaves of the areca palm tree. Then the sheets are collected and washed with turmeric and water. Then the artisans molded these plates into the balls and using heated molds. These plates are then air dried and ready for packaging. No chemical is used in this process and is totally biodegradable in nature. Now let's talk about the single use plates made from the shal leaf. The shal leaf are first picked, checked and partly dried in the sun. Then they are set with tiny sticks. This is the shal leaf plates. Then the leaves are molded into the shape of the plates by using the heated molds. They are totally biodegradable in nature and is affordable. Now let's talk about the jute fiber. Jute is one of the most affordable natural fiber with a golden and silky shine. Jute plant is first harvested and then submerged in the slow running water. The non-fibrous part is scrapped off and the fibrous part is collected by the farmers. Many things can be made from these fibers such as ropes, bags, curtains, gunny sacks, etc. Instead of using the plastic bag, we should use these jute bags as these are more light in weight, durable, affordable and moreover eco-friendly in nature. Jute bags are also UV protected so food items can be stored here safely. These bags are also known as the brown paper bag as mostly gunny bags are used to store the rice, wheat, grains etc. Now let's talk about the bamboo. Bamboo is the world's fastest growing plant. Due to its antibacterial property, many things can be made from it such as baskets, plates, balls, etc. And these are totally biodegradable in nature and is also reusable and recyclable. Now let's talk about the soap nut also known as Rita. This is the soap nut which is a fruit of the Rita tree. Soap nut contains saponin. Saponin is a perfect cleanser to wash clothes, dishes, cars and many more. Being a fruit, uh, it does not pollute the nature. Hence, it is eco-friendly and also affordable. Now, let's talk about the coconut coil. Coil is the natural fiber extracted from the outer husk of the coconut. Being a natural element, being a natural element, it costs very less and totally biodegradable in nature. Many things can be made from the coconut such as rope, rope, mattress, fertilizers and many more. Now, I have given a brief description on the some of the eco-friendly materials. We should implement these materials in our day-to-day -day life to prevent our earth from getting polluted and make our future a better place to live. Thank you.